welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel and today we got another snack crate video, baby. So if you're familiar with how I do these snack crate videos, I do not know where these snacks are from. I'm just gonna get right into it, okay? So it says Moika Rachel Kinch, M-O-I-K-K-A, which I did look up what that means, and it means hello in Finnish. So, I'm assuming these might be from Finland, which I'm stoked about. So, let's just get right into it. I'm going to go ahead and open these up with my keys. Alrighty, you know the drill. Drum roll, please. This snack crate is from... Finland. Ugh. This snack crate has been sitting for a couple weeks because I just like literally haven't had time to film. These are the stickers. Oh, oh my gosh, this guy right here <laughs> is what this is looking like. Cool. So let's just start off by reading some facts. Why not? So, Finland. Capital is Helsinki. 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 I don't know. Established December 6, 1917. Population 5 million. Wow. So there are more saunas than cars in Finland. Wow. Every July. In a place in Finland that I cannot even begin to pronounce, the wife carrying world championship takes place. Wow. So the speeding fines in Finland are calculated on the violator's total income. Millionaires can face up to $100,000 when driving faster than the speed limit. Oh my god. Good to know because my speeding ticket would not be shit in Finland. <laughs> let's, just, let's just get right into it, okay? We're opening it up. Oh, sorry. I know some people like to see how it looks before I dig right into it. Okay. <gasps> Ooh, chips! Right, so we're going to start with chips, like always. And here we have hearts. Corn snacks with nacho cheese flavor. I already love the sounds of that. So this is taffel. Hearts. You're going to heart these savory heart-shaped corn bites flavored with zesty nacho cheese. Oh. Mmm. They smell good. Mmm. And they taste good. I honestly don't know what I can compare them to. Just love the shape and the textures of these because it's hollow. Mmm. I like the flavor and the crunch. Finland knows what they're doing when it comes to these hearts. Ooh, I like the sound of this. Okay, so this is also by the brand Taffel. And um, these are Broadway. Sour cream and onion chips. Crunchy, rigid potato chips dusted with savory sour cream and onions. So let's see if they got anything on Lay's. Because I like Lay's sour cream and onion. Ooh, it smells different. Okay. So it does taste like sour cream and onion. It's okay. It's definitely not as flavorful as other sour cream and onion chips that I've had. Okay, so we're going to move on to these. This is some sort of a gummy. And these are called Moomin. Fruit candies, natural flavors, gelatin free. Love that. These are mini Moomin. Named after a popular comic character, these delicious gummies have been popular since the 1950s. Sweet. So we got strawberry flavor, orange, 
pear, and pomegranate. What? Excuse me. If I can ever get them open. I'm just about to use my teeth, honestly. Jeez. Woo! I knew that was going to happen. They smell so good. Okay, so I'm about to go in with the strawberry flavor. Mmm. Yum. Those are really good gummies. Thinking this is pomegranate? Okay, I don't really know if this actually tastes like a pomegranate, but it tastes really good. Honestly, A+. Plus. Okay, moving on to these. These look interesting. Tyrkisk? Tyrkisk? Peeber Hot and Sour. Can you handle it? These intense candies feature fruity hard candy shells filled with a salty licorice powder. I mean, that honestly sounds like nothing I would ever want, but we're gonna go with it. So, okay. I'm just gonna do a blue one. Let's, let's go baby. So far, the flavor is really nice. Okay, I'm starting to bite into it. No! 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 Okay, literally, when they said salty, there's a literal salt that comes bursting out of those. I don't really like those at all. It sucks because the hard shell candy part tastes really good. But honestly, I don't wanna go through that. I'm gonna eat me a gummy, I don't wanna go through that. Okay, next we're gonna go in with Geisha. First of all, I love this packaging. Very pretty. This would definitely catch my eye if it was here in America. But this is sweet hazelnut cream with crispy bits of hazelnut praline, then coated with rich milk chocolate. So that sounds divine. I'm gonna get a block off and I'm just gonna take a bite. Mmm. Mmm. Very, very good. Very, very rich and smooth. I am feeling the bits of hazelnut, but I'm not really tasting hazelnut. I kind of just taste chocolate, which is fine. I mean, because it's pretty good, so I can't complain. This is what it looks like in the inside. Some damn good chocolate. Okay, next is Susu. This is the Susu bar. This candy bar features a sweet toffee filling covered in crispy rice, then dipped in delicious milk chocolate. I'm really not the type of gal for these types of chocolate. I hate, I hate the crunch bar. I've never been a fan of that. So, but the sweet toffee filling, I mean, that's intriguing. So I guess, okay, never mind. That sweet toffee filling is actually so good. It tastes like caramel. Mmm. Okay, that's good. Okay, so the next is Tupla or Tupla Max. So this is a cocoa nugget. Oh, cocoa nougat, my bad. 
covered in roasted almonds, then dipped in milk chocolate. A finished favorite since 1960. Okay, so there's two little bits like this. Okay, so here we go. Mmm. This, to me, sort of tastes like a three musketeer, but the filling more chocolatey like. I really like that, that's really good. Brady, so next is Jim. <laughs> Jim Bar, this unique combination of fruity whipped filling and dark chocolate has delighted Finnish snackers since 1958. Hmm. What the heck was that? So, fruity whipped filling. I wonder what the fruit is. I wonder if it says zero English on this except for Jim. So this is what we're going with. No. I think it's like a cherry filling. And I don't really like cherry. I don't like cherry filling or cherry candy really. No, to that one. Next, we have Carl Fazer Mito Sukla. I'm sorry. I'm I know I'm butchering that. I have no clue what 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 that. I can't I'm meh. From the iconic Finnish candy maker Phaser, this milk chocolate bar is made from only the finest cocoa. So it's just chocolate. See, I like chocolate, but I really like my chocolate to be filled with something like peanut butter, caramel, or like hazelnut. Let's give it a try. Mmm. Mmm. But when it's just chocolate and the chocolate is this good, I'm okay with it. Praise. That is some good, silky, smooth, rich, creamy chocolate. Mmm. I need a drink of water after that one. Last but not least, I saw this one and I immediately was like, I'm intrigued, I'm going to save this one for last. So it is a uh, Salmiaki. I'm sorry, but I'm thinking of Salmonella. I don't know why, Salm Salmiaki. These bite-sized salted licorice pieces, no. Are the perfect introduction to traditional Finish Salmiac candy. Okay. So what's up with the salt and licorice? Can someone tell me? I am very interested in why that's a thing. Oh, y'all are gonna trip. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's like a gummy. Oh, you guys, it tastes like straight salt. That is so salty, nasty, gross. I don't think, I don't think I, I don't, where, where's the licorice part coming in? What is that supposed to come through? Oh my gosh. Alrighty, everybody, so that is the end of this video i hope that you enjoyed this snack crate box also i'm not trying to offend anybody with my opinions i just 
I'm just doing this for fun, okay? And I think it's really fun, and I like to tell you how I feel about each snack or candy. But yeah, with that being said, please feel free to leave, feel free to leave a comment down below of any requests of videos that you would like to see from me in the future, or if you just want to chat. That's cool too. Please give this video a huge thumbs up. It really helps out my channel and I really appreciate it. Also, do not forget to subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Bye!